but I know one of you in here, I'm not sure which yet, one of you will make more money in the next 12 months than all of those two guys that mentions name, all their flocks together, combined, cumulatively. I know that for a fucking fact. But that's not, they don't use those benchmarks. They don't measure those things. They measure the smiling faces they got on Facebook. And, and uh, she wouldn't say shit if it was in her mouth before. Now she says, link fuck, face fuck. I mean, I didn't believe it. I mean, that young woman wouldn't say shit if it was in her mouth. And now listen to her. God, she sounds like a fucking a female drill sergeant. I got plenty, of, not on YouTube, I got plenty of stories to tell you about female drill sergeants. Let's say that they're a breed apart. We'll leave it. At, we'll suffice it at that. Um, but she's um, she's doing well. She's doing well. And uh, in her particular case, I'm I'm not the world renowned expert, but I'm a big fucking expert. And so it was easier for me to say yes to her. Um, and uh, but she didn't need that six hundred dollar book. Believe me, that's steady. Even though I've told you this, I will bet you a thousand pounds to one pound, just like that. Uh, that at least one of you is going to buy a study. At least one. Maybe two. Maybe three. I guarantee it. Because even though you heard her, and even though I'm telling you, so who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Better you burn the money in the fucking fireplace. Or like I told her, $600 wouldn't get dinner for me. But anyway, you know, take me to dinner and spend the fucking money. Don't, I mean, don't waste it on a fucking study. Because I basically, what she didn't say is, I basically told her the final paragraph of the study without reading the fucking study because I, you know, I'm, I'm aware of it. I'm aware of it. I'm aware of it. And there are different niches in healthcare and there's different niches in IT, telco, um, I mean, there's hundreds would be an exaggeration, but dozens for sure, many dozens. And if you're in Norway, you're not going to compete with the guys in the UK. If you're in Spain, you're not going to compete with the guys in fucking uh, uh, South Africa. And if you're in uh, New Zealand, you're not going to compete with the guys in fucking South America. Uh, so there's plenty to go around. There's plenty to go around. And I hope I have the problem that three or four of you guys in one industry, it's so fucking big, and then we'll merge you. Because I've had to do that a couple of times over oh, 23 years. We merge them. And not everybody's happy in the merger, but the bottom line is you made a lot of money, you created a lot of wealth, and you have more choices. So for the fuckheads that want to save the world, Create wealth and have more choices. That's a pretty simple formula. For those of you that don't give a fuck about the world, just make a lot of fucking money. Fuck the world. And the horse they rode in on. One of the guys in the questions asked me, um, oh, they want to know why I don't just get, put the seminar out and the whole day and on YouTube. Give back and you'll, the world will be a better place. I said, fuck the world. I'm not trying to make the world a better place. I hope that answers your question, kid. You make the world a better place by creating wealth, by reading three or 400 books, and then you save the world and stop global warming, etc. Any questions about um, uh, Kira? She was very structured. That's the way she, she is. You know, da, 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 da. Now, I'm not saying that's bad. I'm not saying it's good. It's her way. Just as each one of you will figure it out for yourself. What makes more sense? Yes, sir. Does she listen to any type of music that keeps her focused, or is she just? No, I don't think so. I say this, Kira. I don't know. Maybe some Chinese. I, I have no idea. I don't know. I, I'm being a smart ass. No, I don't know. <laughs> And I'm going to get some fucking shit on YouTube. Somebody's going to say, you're, I'm, you're slagging off Asian, you're slagging off Chinese. Yes, I am. That's correct, I am. Uh, yeah, but I, I, I don't know. I don't know what she listens to. I have no fucking idea. 
um, I don't care. And the, um, she was, I, I was almost going to stop her because I thought she was going to mention these guys' names, but she didn't. Yeah, I thought, uh, you know, I was going to, but she didn't. Okay. Because these guys don't need a bunch of fucking calls and emails and shit. But the one person she mentioned is on another board of mine. And uh, smart, smart lady, extremely gifted lady. And, um, but um, the, and there's, a lot of, there's a lot of gifted people. And I think she was very candid when she said, why would, can I get this done? Because that's the real question you ask. Can I, you know, I don't give a fuck about all those people. I don't give a fuck about all these webinars. Can I get it fucking done? And, you know, most people go through, question yourself, can you get it done? I'm, I know, I know you can, if you want to, bad enough. And then the, the other thing she said was, you know, why would these people want to be part of my deal? Uh, she's, I think she's 27. Um, just, you know, just a kid. <sighs> Albeit a smart one, but I mean, she doesn't know a dick about this industry either. She, this is not the industry uh, that she studied and, you know, have all those letters after her name. That's why I asked her, uh, and I was hoping she answered the right way. Did that have anything to do with, no, no, because it doesn't. Whether you have letters or you don't have letters, doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean anything. Because uh, you're, you're not applying for a job, a, a professorship at Oxford. You're not trying to be an Oxford Don. You're not. I'm going to have to fold my robe next week and, you know. Uh, we have a lot of people that are applying for, um, um, to come and listen to me from my stable of uh, devotees. So I don't, um, and again, not everybody's going to get in, kids. Oxford was kind enough to say there's some additional seating for some of the, my devotees, but I mean, that doesn't mean the fuck you're all going to get in. So just, you know, don't, don't cry. And we have some people calling six and seven times to make six and seven reservations. Six or seven. And I mentioned one of the names to uh, Craig. He says, yeah, how'd you know? Trust me. I mean, when I mentor you for a year and uh, you go through the Castle Seminar, I know. And then I said, what about this one? Yeah, that's another one. I just know. I just know. Um, but um, so you know, hopefully as many, uh, uh, we'll try to get in as many as we can. Um, so uh, we're going we're gonna to film it. And I plan on putting it on... Uh, if I have the rights, I, I got to ask them for the intellectual rights and go through all that shit, and I don't know if they'll let me, but I'm going to film it anyway, if nothing else, so we can use here, even if they don't let me put it out on YouTube, uh, so we can use here. Any questions about Kira? Anything else? What was the takeaway from her? Yeah, well, so when I said, well, when we're sitting in the private time, what's the quickest way? Change your phone number. Now, I didn't think she'd do it. I didn't. With the greatest respect here, I mean, it's, that's, not e that's not fucking easy. The guy before I said, if you don't have my number, go fuck yourself. Now, I know she didn't do that. Well, I say that. I don't know if she did that. I doubt if she did it that way. But, I mean, the guy that did it, that's, as they would say, that's pretty fucking cold. You know? And especially if your mother's one of the ones that <laughs> calling the number. Uh, but yeah, because she, she, she said, what's the easiest way? Well, if you don't want to explain to everybody why you're doing this, just change the number. You can tell she's serious because she ran out the door. She's doing it full time. Yeah. Yeah. She is. She is. Anything else about Kira? Okay, YouTube, thank you. We'll see you tonight.